Hello everybody, it's Umbellas. Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're gonna be doing a challenge by Fake Gamer Girl. So FGG came up with this quite weird cash challenge and we're gonna be doing this cash challenge today. So I have screenshotted this just so that I can zoom in a little bit. It's quite blurry, but I mean, it's still readable. But anyway, so we're gonna start with the sim type, birth month. So my birth month is March, which means we're gonna be having a werewolf. Beautiful, all right, so let's create Oh, God damn it. Let's create a werewolf. Okay, so here is our werewolf. Beautiful, beautiful. We're just gonna go to the human form. All right, so next up is hair color. Your bad habit. Nail biting, you know, which is actually accurate because, you know, I'm a nail biter. But the only thing is, I don't have black hair. Nose picking, green hair. Lip chewing, red hair. Short, what? Spot picking, pink hair. I'm not sure what spot picking is. Is that like squeezing pimples? I don't know. Scratching your butt and then sniffing it. Blonde hair, fart sniffing, brown hair, booger, bo booger eating, blue hair, refusing to admit to any of this, purple hair. Okay, so apparently I'm a fart sniffer because I have brown hair. Alright, so yeah, okay, cool, we already have brown hair. I just want to quickly take away some of the accessories over here. I don't think I'm actually gonna recreate myself. You know, I actually might try and recreate myself again because I have created myself in The Sims before. But you know, I have never really accurately made myself in this game, so I'm actually gonna try to do that again. Maybe I do it better this time, I don't know. Now, I'm not gonna show each and every detail of this process because, I mean, it can take a while to actually perform perfect your own face in this game okay like this 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 face shape is just not me i have a very subtle chin if i have to be completely honest i have a straight bridge for my nose my ears are not that big it's not also very bulgy if that's the right term but okay i'm just gonna choose a random pair of lips i don't have thick lips so i'm not gonna give myself thick lips you know i wish i'm just gonna go with this with this face and my eyes is a little bit you know close to each other okay that's the furthest we could go there i'm gonna give myself some generic eyebrows uh maybe like this yeah sure there we go i have a little bit of a puffy cheek situation i do not have chiseled jaw or anything like yeah okay my lips are still a little bit too thick but you know what that's okay we're just doing this for fun today right i'm just gonna give myself a hairstyle that's very similar to my current hairstyle oh my god stop what the hell stop thanks i want to give myself a medium length Wait, that was part of the challenge. Hold on a second. Um, so we're gonna go to the screenshots. There you go. Okay, wait. Okay, yeah, there you go. Hair length. Okay, but we, we, we can wait on that one for a bit. Okay, hair length. Um, did you poop today? Yes, short hair. No, medium hair. Haven't pooped in a while, to be honest. Long hair. So, you know... This is TMI, but it's also accurate. No, I have not, but yes, I do have medium hair, so <laughs> that is accurate. Go back to the Sims. Alrighty. So beautiful. We're gonna go with the medium option, although I might not find my actual hair length here, but we have to go medium, so let's just go with the medium category. <laughs> but yeah, okay, here is a nice hairstyle. I feel we could go with this hairstyle. Alright, but anyway, our aesthetic has to do with our favorite movie genre, right? So we have romance, goth, action, comedy, drama, thriller, fantasy. My favorite movie genre, believe it or not, is actually between thriller and horror. So we can go between coquettes and goth. I would say horror. So we're gonna go gothic. All right. So we're gonna go in with some super dark makeup. We're gonna go typical goth on this girl today with some nice dark, maybe purple lips. I don't know. And how can I forget the lashes? Holy crap. Like we really need the lashes. In terms of jewelry, we can maybe go with these, which are kind of big. These look so heavy. Like I wouldn't wear earrings like that in my whole life. Like that just looks so uncomfortable. Maybe we can go with these spiky earrings or we can just go with, I don't know, these hearts. Yeah, the hearts are kind of cute. And in terms of necklaces, I believe we can just go with something simple like a choker or some fine jewelry. But I'm gonna go with the oh. choker. Yeah, okay, we see you, we see you. I'm only gonna do the everyday, of course, you know, because I don't I don't think it's necessary to go through each and every outfit. So because we're a werewolf, we can still go according to the werewolfy style, but, you know, werewolf slash 
gothic. But I will tweak our werewolf form a little bit just for funsy. So we can go with this outfit, which is pretty cute and gothic enough in my opinion. Oh, I like the flowers. That's adorable. I'm actually gonna go with the red straps. Those are so cool. I love the little backpack. That's adorable. Ow! I just wish they could stop howling like that though. Alright, so let's just go for a nice oh. shoe. Oh, I kind of love this combination, but that's not accurate to the gothic style, I believe. So let's go in for some lovely sneakers, because that is the best at the end of the day. And we're obviously going to go in for a lovely stocking of some sort. I wish FTG added more options to the challenge that you could read through and go through in the process of making your sim. Even though it's short, you still get a nice laugh out of the challenge. How about these stripy socks? Yeah, I suppose that's cute. Maybe we can go with a plain inner shoe color then yeah you know that that's cute that okay no wait that's a little bit confusing yeah no that's better oh we, we can go with these oh yeah oh i like the rainbow um thingies there jesus can you just stop doing that what else do we have in terms of this okay so we have the favorite movie we have the Hair length, okay, and then extras. Breakfast habits. Cereal before the milk, add scars. Milk after the cereal, add eye bags. Don't like cereal, add freckles. Don't eat breakfast, add tattoos. Now, I have to be completely honest. I actually don't eat breakfast. I know to many of you it might sound unhealthy or something, but the thing is, every time I wake up in the morning, it feels like my stomach is literally non-existent. It's so small. Like, I do not even have the stomach capacity, can I say, to even drink coffee so early in the morning. So, no, I really am not a breakfast eater, so I'm gonna have to add tattoos, which is cool because it's gonna add to the style that we're doing. So, let's go in for tattoos. Tattoos. So we can look at some awesome tattoos. I mean, we can add some dirt to the fingers and the hands because I mean we are werewolf and we uh we like getting dirty now and then. Uh oh, I like the rose. I just don't like the fact that the rose is on my hand. It would be cool to have it on the arm or something Ow. somewhere. Oh, that's pretty legit. Can you like <coughs> stop doing that? And then uh for the other arm, I suppose we could go in for a flower, like it's cute though. Doesn't need to be gothic all the way. Something for the ankles. Ooh, the cow plant. Obviously, I love the cow plant tattoo. We can have another cow plant. Oh yes, I love it. Maybe we can actually go crazy with the tattoos. <gasps> we have a neck tattoo. It's a can 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 it can you stop? We have a neck tattoo. I did not know that, uh, what's, it, what's, what's its face, uh, Lovestruck brought that in. I didn't see it. I'm honest now. But is it only that that we have for the neck tattoo? Oh, that sucks though. Like, it would have been cool to have more options for the neck tattoo. Anyway, we do have an open back, so we can add some lovely tattoos here. Oh, the wolf! Oh, that's perfect! And it is actually from werewolves as well. Oh, that is probably the most legit tattoo though. But I'm gonna go with the wolf because, you know, she's a werewolf. But yeah, that is all there is to FGG's crazy ass challenge. I really did, you know, enjoy this. I mean, I did get a good laugh out of it. I mean, did you poop today? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you should be honest here. I'm pretty sure you must be honest though. I, I don't know about Well, let's just quickly break the chains here <laughs> and take away the clothes. I just want to add a few things here. Oh, should I maybe keep the choker? <gasps> I didn't know there's a key at the back. I was wondering, for those of you who have done the the thingy majiggy that has to do with the Reaper event, like, did you guys get any good rewards there? I saw that you can actually unlock a very cool eye color, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna do it. Like, I just feel it it's a little bit boring and that I'm probably not gonna enjoy it. But I don't know, if you guys would like to see me do some of that in terms of the Reaper reward uh, thingy majiggy, let me know. I'm actually gonna base this werewolf off of my dog. That's a good idea. Uh, where Where's the freaking colors and stuff now? How do we do this? The coat pattern and colors and stuff. Yeah, there we go. Black. Now I'm gonna go completely black because my doggo is completely black. She's actually very, very dark uh -oh. brown but it's such a dark brown that you would say it's actually black so we're gonna go with black i don't know if it's faster to do it this way or if it's more tedious to do it this way you know i don't really care i just actually love doing the spray paint and the this stuff but yeah bella is basically a 
very 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 dark brown dog which basically makes her black it would have been cool to hear the spray paint sound effect when spray painting the werewolves and stuff and the pits because you hear nothing when you do this unless i just have a certain setting turned down in my sound i don't know bella has no white in her face but she does have white on her chest like um perhaps just a, a little stripy majiggy that almost looks like a little diamond of some sort you know something wonky like that and then on her feet she has white tips but that's only for her hind legs so i'm gonna do that for the toesies do we have a tail? No, we don't have a tail. I feel like we need a tail here because, uh, wait, can, can we even have a tail? I haven't ever seen a tail with the werewolves. I think that might have been a mod or something, but yeah. If I could have added a tail, I would have added a little white dot on the tip of her tail because, yeah, she does have one in real life. But yeah, okay, this is us in our werewolf form. Beautiful. But yeah, you guys, if you would like to see more of Fake Gamer Girl, this is her handle right over there. Fake Gamer Girl official. Please go follow their channel because uh, her channel is great you'll get a great laugh watching her videos her content and everything i really enjoy you know especially on a day when i'm feeling a little bit down to just scroll through her channel and look for the craziest thumbnail and just click on it and basically laugh my ass off they are an absolute amazing content creator i would actually like to add a little bit to this video by just briefly checking out what this reaper rewards event is about so they say wait for the ambrosia society newsletter do we have expedite mail delivery buy the gramophone and ask the spirits about ambrosia okay oh that's the recipe to revive sims from the dead or something like that i think you can give it to grim and then he can prevent the sim from actually passing on you know what did you just do did you do that okay so we just have to wait for the whatever your mail will receive i mean your mail will arrive shortly okay good so we have to buy the gramophone apparently just quickly want to you know, just check out what this Reaper reward re 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 reward event is about. Oh, uh, claim the gramophone reward from the event and buy it from build mode in the electronics category. I'm not sure. Oh, there's more. Ask three th sims about Ambrosia. Order a starter flower seed packet. We can do that quickly. All right, here's starter flowers. And then they say we should plant a lily. Alrighty. Research a plant. I cannot research search it yet because i think it needs to start growing is there any plants here that we can research oh wait a second this plant is out of season that's not a good thing shouldn't be out of season so i suppose we should just create a little shelter over here hopefully this will work is it in season yeah cool now we can water it beautiful i know that looks horrible it's not accurate at all but yeah there we go uh let's get the mail thank you mail lady uh what did we oh okay we can have this book and we can claim the okay okay so we are actually close to completing the step to get the gramophone like oh that's cool i must unlock that hold on a second and the other thing that i really wanted oh look at that bike oh my gosh these are... okay these are actually super cool rewards look at that eye like i want that eye top that's legit and a new coffin excuse me now i'm wondering you know that thing that they said about grim that we basically thought would be i don't know a game pack or an expansion pack is it actually gonna be an expansion pack or is this what that thing is all about i'm pretty sure it's not i'm pretty sure there's an actual grim reaper expansion coming what's this about okay well okay let's read that read the ambrosia newsletter okay cook a recipe recipe well level three or higher i'm not level anything in cooking crap so what can we do we can for now just talk to the spirits okay there we go ask the spirits about ambrosia or the spirits I'm gonna ask yeah. them okay plant a snapdragon apple tree and cherry cherry tree okay snap snap snapple dragon we have a snapdragon do we have an apple or cherry whoa 
Do you really need to grow all of those? But yeah, I just wanted to roughly check out what the Reaper Rewards is about. There are some more things we can do. Uh, let's talk to the Sims. Say hi. Snuff and introduce. I haven't played with the werewolves in a while. We're gonna ask you about Ambrosia. What do you know about the death coming back to life lasagna? Hey, beautiful. Stand still, I want to talk to you. Let's quickly sniff you. Not weird at all. Ask about Ambrosia. Okay, great. Uh, is there somewhere a third sim we can ask? You. Sniff that guy over there. Hello, hello. What do you know about Ambrosia? Okay, here we can have the gramophone. Beautiful. And another book. Oh wow, the event actually ends in 51 days, which is incredible. Okay, here we can buy the gramophone. You can summon the Grim Reaper through the gramophone? Oh, that's so cool. I love the Grim Reaper. Like, he's the most iconic freaking thing ever. Ah, uh, hello. Will you marry me? Let's sniff and introduce ourselves <laughs> to Grim. Can I sniff your butt? Is it okay? He's like, yeah, sure, I love it. Kind of. All right, so there's nothing else we should do with Grim by the looks of it. <gasps> oh, almost there. Okay, now we're gonna research Ambrosia on our phone. Cool, okay, almost, almost. And all we need to do now is research a plant, really. Unless we just do some cooking in order to get that cooking level skill to number three. But I have to get my gardening skill higher in order to get to three and there's no other plants that I can really work with in order to get my gardening skill up. So I suppose I'm just quickly gonna cook a few things to at least get our cooking skill to number three. But yeah, if I do continue this Reaper reward event thingy-majiggy, I'm actually gonna continue it with this sim that we made in the cast challenge. But yeah, do let me know if you want to see me continue with the Reaper reward. If not, that's no problem. I will probably do that on my own time. But if you guys want to see me go through the process, like I said, just let me know. But yeah, this is where I'm going to leave today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you all in the next one.